Hello everyone and welcome back to New Tech. Today we're going to compare the new TechWall GTX versus S20 smartwatch. We will do some tests and see what we got in the software. Let's see here the tick watch. As you can see, we have a very good face. Immediately, press and hold to change it. We have two buttons on the side. At the top, we have time, percentage of battery, do not disturb, alarm. We have and we have settings and other uh, shortcuts. Down. At the left, we have here heart rate, hours of sleep stopwatch timer sunny or the weather and we have here the sports outdoor running outdoor cycling jump rope swimming indoor uh, rowing mountain climbing indoor run and we have gymnastic soccer basketball indoor cycling and yoga so we have quite a few options for uh, the sports we have notifications here as you can see they work pretty good and we have the history about throughout the day what we did so basically this is what we'll find in the tick watch press and hold to change the face so we have quite a few options and things to do in the tick watch new great faces that we can change in the app as well so that is what we have in the tick watch so here in the s20 now you can see the toss bar we have the brightness that we can raise with the plus sign and we have the time as well after that we have some shortcuts about settings qr code find phone and percentage of battery and the left we will enter the menu as you can see the sports and the right as well down we have notification so let's see here at the right we have steps that we did throughout the day we have hours of sleep heart rate blood pressure blood oxygen and acg and we have here music control, weather, alarm, and timer. We have here photo and the sports as well. As you can see, running, walking. We have hiking, swimming, badminton, tennis, bike. We have yoga, rope jump, football, and we have the history as well. So basically, this is what we have in the S20, press and hold to change your face in the S20, you can see it's very simple and we have quite a few options here as well as in the app that we can download more. So this is the S20. So let's begin here with some tests in the TechWatch GTX, we saw the software, now I think we have to try here outdoor running, as you can see the seconds going immediately, the time at the top, heart rate, burn calories, and that's basically it for a watch uh, with this price and this good looking, I think we should have more options to watch, but you will get more information when you stop your uh, sport. And let's me, let me just strap this more closely to my wrist and try the heart rate, see how it will measure. As you can see immediately we have the first result and we have the statistic uh, here at the watch which is a good thing. Also we have highest and lowest heart rate that we measured. As you can see we already have here highest lowest and we have a couple of information at down below at the statistic which looks really good and again it's very useful
basically this is the heart rate in the GTX. Let's go here and see what we have more. You can see we have a brightness power off and about. So basically this is what we have in the tick watch. So let's see. So basically this is all that we can test and do in the TechWatch GTX. So let's do some tests here. We saw what we got in the software before. Let's start with heart rate and let's see how fast this device will measure our heart rate. As you can see the first result just came fast enough and let's see how fast this will be done. So the heart rate will take a very long time I'm not sure why but the heart rate in the S20 takes the most of the time in the health caring group and as you can see finally we have the final result let's see now the blood pressure and how fast this will measure You can see we have here the final result of the blood pressure now we are at the blood oxygen this one as same as blood pressure will measure our health very much faster than the heart rate and as you can see we have the percentage here now we are at the ACG so again even the ACG will measure our health faster than the heart rate. As you can see we have the first result at the ACG. And as, uh, as I always say all these results will be saved in the app so we can check out later what we did. We saw on the how to connect video how they are saved all with statistic and all the things. So here at the sports we have running 3 second countdown as you can see the time at the top. We have second seconds going underneath it. We have burn calories, blood pressure measurements and kilometers. So these are the only options that we have in the S20 smartwatch. We don't think we have anything else to test here. So guys, this was all for today's video. I hope you find this video interesting and helpful. If so, hit the like button, subscribe to our channel. And we will see you in the next video with another smart device.